And there she is, getting her done. Many of the top curlers in the world will be heading to Calgary for this week's Humpty's Champions Cup as the Grand Slam season wraps up. This is Calgary's Chelsea Carey. She is one of them, and she hopes to cap the year with a victory on her home turf, as it will be the last competition before changes come to her team. Good morning to you, Chelsea. Good morning. We just saw you there, just yelling. You and I were saying, it has to be done. It's part of the game. This is what you do. Yeah, it's kind of the deal. That's kind of the deal, because you're a skip. Exactly. exactly. What's it going to be like for you playing right now, knowing that there's some big changes afoot with your team? Yeah, it's, it's different for sure. It's, um, the Olympics has changed curling a lot that way. We're at the end of a quadrennial, so there's lots of shuffling. And then it happens right after the Scotties, typically. And so then you're, you know, there's a whole bunch of teams there that know they're not curling together next year. And so it's interesting, but it's, it's fine. I mean, we, we, our, our split was, no, there's no animosity there at all. We're just nice. happy to to get one last event together and get to hang out a little bit and stuff. So it, it's, uh, we're looking forward to it. That's nice. Do you think you guys will get emotional? Uh, I don't know about emotional, but yeah, it, it, it feels, it's a bit of an end of an era kind of a thing, yeah. kind of a feeling. You know, you put, you spend a lot of time together. It's, we always joke that we see each other more than, Your family. the, than families and husbands <laughs> and things. Yeah, because yeah. that's just the reality of the situation. Right. So yeah, definitely, uh, definitely a bit of a, you know, bittersweet kind of a moment. For sure, for sure. Let's talk a little bit about the competition. How tough is it going to be? What does it look like? Yeah, they're always tough. These these Grand Slam events, the, the way that, that um, the invites go out, just being kind of the top teams in the world, it's it's always going to be a really tough field. And so every time you look at the draw, it, it can be daunting because there's no easy games. But, uh, you know, it's it's we, there's there's seven of these events. So we've certainly done it enough that we're familiar with uh, with how that's going to go. But, yeah, it's always it's always a great field. Wonderful. Now you are from Calgary. Is it special to you to sort of wrap up the season here at home? Yeah, I'm really excited about that. We don't get to play at home very much. We we play all the time, and yet all my friends and family in Calgary go, "When do I get to watch you play?" And right. I'm like, "Um, well." <laughs> so yeah, it's um, it's really exciting to get to play at home and to hopefully have some some kind of home crowd support and things. That's we're we're looking forward to that. For That'll sure. be nice yeah. for sure. You can feel all the warmth coming from the stands. Exactly. That's nice. We talked about how it's a little bit cool in these rings, but not when you're out there playing no not in an arena so much it's uh, if you're in a curling club it gets yes. a little chilly but in the arena it's a little warmer for us which is good for sure well let's look ahead to the next Olympics is that something that's on your mind at all right now what's the process you know moving forward to something like that yeah for sure that's um so the shuffle that happens tends to be you're building towards you know hopefully having a team together for four years to kind of build towards the next Olympic cycle and, and going on a on a run first you have to make it to the Olympic trials which in Canada isn't easy in and of itself and then you know trying to come out on top there and, and getting ready to go to the Olympics so yeah that's uh, everyone who's kind of landed with a new team is is thinking in kind of four year four year terms right and so that consistency I would imagine is really a key isn't it yeah it, that's the thing is that's how you get to the Olympic trials is based on a sort of total points accumulation so okay. you have to be playing consistently well you're gonna be qualifying and everything and earning those points that's how that's how that's how you get there. there yeah so so definitely that's a big that's a big factor wonderful so there's gonna be some great curling underway this week uh, you can watch it as well uh, we've got live television coverage of the Humpty's Champions Cup that begins Thursday at noon on Sportsnet fans can also stream the curling action live via Sportsnet now you can also of course go check it out in person the Humpty's Champions Cup is at Windsport Arena Canada Olympic Park it runs today until Sunday Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Have for fun out me. there. Thank you very Looks much. Looks like it's going to be a good time. Yeah, it should be good.